In this short video I'm going to show you how to open uh, a new document in Photoshop and to put your images in that you should have already saved. So what we do is we go to the top here under file and choose new and then we're just going to give it a name here so I'll just call this David as an example and we need to make sure it's set to international paper and then we're just going to go with A4. Okay, don't need to worry about anything else so we just press OK. So this is my canvas now and you can see it's across here it says background but we don't need to worry about much else what we want to do is get our images in first so I'm just going to go across here I've already got them in a folder on my desktop and I'll grab the first one and what we do is we just move it onto the canvas here and let go now you can see that Photoshop's put it in but it's not letting me do anything with it can't really do much other than maybe rotate it and I might not want to do that now so what we have to do is just go to the arrow button here see across there look the move tool and just click and it asks me if I want to place the file which means put it into the document so I will press place if you don't want it you can always press that one I'm going to press place now if I select it now you will see that I've got some handles in the corner now if your Photoshop doesn't do this you just need to tick this little blue arrow here to turn it on and that's really important because then we can resize and rotate it so I've got my show transform controls on there look and what I'll do is here, I'm going to use the corner handles. Remember, we always use the corner handles in software. And I'll get my image. And then if I just go to the outside, look, I can rotate a little bit. So let's maybe put that there, resize it a bit more. And then when I click here, it asks me again, apply the transformation. Do I want to do that? So yes. Try again, let's just rotate it a little bit. Click off and apply. There we go, it's rotated a bit more. So let me go and get another one. I've uh, got a nice picture here of a smartphone, so let's drop that one in. Again, not so sure about that, but I'm just going to press place. And then again, my corner handles look. Let's uh, resize this, let's move it over here. Maybe I'm not going to rotate it a little bit. Okay, I want that a bit smaller actually. Let's put that one over here. Okay. And once we're done again, we press the arrow key and press apply. Now, once you've put all your images on like that, you've made your collage, we're going to do something else with it. But that's the first quick video on how to actually open a new canvas and place the images.